here's what I want to do. I know it's windy, so I hope you can hear me okay. Uh, we're going to boil a sack of crawfish today. And I wanted to try out, because I've, I've heard a lot about these crawfish washing buckets. So let's try one out. See if it really cleans those crawfish so we can spend more time drinking a few beers and hanging out. Let's check this out. So far so good though, that water looks pretty clean. Let's get them in a pot, get them on boil, and uh, let's see how they taste. the corn to it look at the crab claws on that sucker I mean look at this guy look at that look at him claws he, I'm not playing with my food I'm showing the peoples that's some big crawfish so now that we've blasted oh, okay so now that we've blasted through the first tray of crawfish and we can actually talk let's talk about that crawfish washing bucket it's awesome. I does, like it. Does it work good? Mm -hmm. You like it? Mm -hmm. Are the crawfish clean? Mm -hmm. We eating the crawfish. Look, they came out really clean. Yeah, I'm very picky. Huh? I'm very picky. Yeah? So it was good. It kept me entertained. Something for y'all kids to do. <laughs> right? Your kids, man, just leave them out there splashing around in the. Because it does. I mean, pull it away from the house out in the grass. Because, I mean, it's water. The water's going to go everywhere. We washed them for what? 15 minutes, I think. Within 15 minutes, they were completely like just awesome, just clean. And if, I don't really purge my crawfish, but if you're somebody who likes to purge their crawfish, fill it up, you know, at the end, and then cap it, and go ahead and add your salt and so you know, go ahead and purge them right there. If you purge them, if you're the type of person that purges them with salt, you can do it in that bucket as well. Then drain the cap and go ahead and rinse them off again, but uh, and, and clean it out. But yeah, I think it works really well. Mm -hmm. I was really pleased with it. It worked great. I mean, it went, you saw the video, it went from muddy to clean. And the whole time we were drinking beer and hanging out and didn't have to have me or, you know, whoever the rookie to the group is have to sit out there and clean crawfish. <laughs> ice chest was free for Right? The ice chest was for the, free for the beer. To fill up full of beer, you didn't have to clean your crawfish in it. So it works really good. Um, they, they didn't give it to me. I bought the thing. I wanted to try it out. Uh, I'm not sponsored by them or anything, but I should be, <laughs> right? Yeah. Holla at me, y'all. Holla. Holla. But anyways, uh, no, uh, seal of approval. We couldn't really find anybody actually talking about it online. So here we go. This is me running my mouth. I like it. It was 70 bucks, y'all. They had a smaller one too, but just get the bigger one. They're not that different in price. Get the bigger one. We did what? It was a 30 something pound sack. 35. 35 pound sack no problem fit in there good and it really does clean them well y'all put them in there turn it on out in the yard come back get your ball ready have beers with your friends and hang out so yeah, i like just, it just have the kids watch them because they do like to splash out a little yeah some of them crawfish try to get get uh, a little escape you know from shawshank out. so yep. they try to run from you so they will sometimes kind of splash up out the top you got to throw them back in but that's a perfect activity for the kids anyways I got to go pull a second batch because we, we, we kind of got another little thing soaking. So, all right, y'all. Seal of approval. Yeah, it's good. We'll see y'all next time, man. Thanks for watching. Go buy the damn thing. It works, right? Uh -huh. All right, here we go. Bye, y'all.